Welcome back, it's me again. I have a cool video to show you. This is a uh, 2007 Lexus LS460. Uh, it came here for a noise, uh, knocking noise. Uh, I came to find out that it's the uh, AC compressor. So, uh, show you this. Hey. Uh, let me show you this compressor. That is the oil filter. And that's the compressor. And it takes about 9 to 10 hours to remove it, according to the book. And right there, as you can see, this engine cradle has to come off because it's too close to there. And you see that stud? The compressor stud that really is what's causing it what's gonna make it hard because you have to slide the compressor out that way and it's gonna hit that it's gonna hit that um, body frame of the vehicle so they want you to drop it down a little and that's how you'll be able to get to that compressor but, and I want this rack and pinions out the way they want everything they want all that out the way but uh I think I can do it better than that so uh I will uh show you a photo of uh how the manufacturer uh wants you to remove it and then I'll show you a picture step by step of uh how I got it out. So, uh, this should be pretty cool. I work at Lexus dealership for a while, but never had to do a uh, compressor on a Lexus LS460. So, it's gotta be fun. lines off. See, this line is I believe the high high pressure line. It's kind of hard to get in there. I used I used, I used this tool. Quarter inch a 10 mil a short uh, 10 mil uh, open and end, I mean uh, open and box end ratcheting and uh, this one but the long one did not really help me the one that really helped me is this guy but you can do either or and then I'm taking this low pressure line off and once I take that off that will give me a clear tell me give me a clearance uh, should give me a good clearance yep let me set up my flashlight yeah no that should give me a good clearance here all right I can stick a stick a tool and uh my hand show you okay put my long extended ratchet 3 8 in there to remove that top bolt by the way this is the stud that holds the compressor so this side is bolted to the engine and 
you're supposed to slide the compressor that way but once I took the nut off I took the stud off too so <laughs> if you can get lucky removing the studs on this compressor then that 10 hour 9 hours 9 hours 10 hours job will save you about 8 hours and uh, instead of 10 probably do it in about 2 hours but um I'm about to take the other two on top on the other side and then uh if that works then uh should be out but if that doesn't work then I have no choice but to drop this subframe so you get the idea of where we're going right so I'll keep you I'll keep you updated so I'm back again but uh like I said, I'm going to keep updating you, and uh, here it is. So there's the compressor, I got all the studs out. Took me a while because you got to put your arm in there and put the ratchet, but like I said, it can be done. So the next move is this, and this out. Should be able to pull it from the other side all the way up there but uh she's out she's out i don't have to remove this and the subframe and that's what you call easy peas so uh thank you for watching and i uh, hope you enjoyed this video